this is absolutely my heart. Fort Sam Houston National Cemetery was packed for the Wreaths Across America ceremony. Judy Carlisle spearheaded the event. Her husband, Jim, served in the Air Force for 23 years. He died from Alzheimer's in 2008. And it has been such a unbelievable loss but this is the best way I know to continue to honor him. Her hard work paid off. Thousands of people showed up, including local bikers who did a wreath ride. We think that it's very important that everyone honor them. I was inspired by all these fallen vets. Felix and Penny's son is one of the fallen vets. Just days before 20-year-old John Farias was killed in Afghanistan, he sent his first and last video to his parents. I hope you and dad are, are doing good. I hope dad's doing good. I, I know he's up. Uh, Fardias died in June of last year. Fast forward to his family's second holiday season without him, and they're here at this ceremony to honor his service. It will never be the same. Christmas will never, never be the same. It's just a time when, you know, people stop in their busy life during Christmas and remember that there was sacrifice and there was um, separated families. 9,910 holiday wreaths just like this one were placed at the grave sites here today. But organizers say they would like to see every grave site at this cemetery covered with one. And there are more than 120,000 grave sites here. All these people deserve them. But it's not just about Jim. It's about every single person that's laid to rest beside him, in front of and behind him. Christina Coleman, Fox News at 9.